Anne Leroy Sinew, a Filipino fine artist, born on 1986 at General Santos City. Leroy New is a great Filipino contemporary artist whose works intersect with theater, film, fashion, and visual arts. Psycho Pompous is one of his famous artwork on 2008, after the Greek creature that leads the souls of the dead to their place in Hades. Yet, the ironically cherub face and surprisingly cherry angel becomes a contradiction by adding the word Pompous. Ronald Ventura was born in 1973 in the city of Manila, Philippines. He is a leading Filipino contemporary artist and is renowned for his paintings and sculptures that feature complex multi-layering, combining images and varied styles from hyperrealism to cartoons and graffiti. One of his artworks is the karaoke booth. Ventura said he used the nostalgic black and whites in the displayed artworks in Rome to create something that felt classic and linked to the past. Pointed out that all the happenings in the background is the past. Venus Concepcion is a Filipino painter based in Manila, Philippines who combines the motif of classical landscape with contemporary caricatures and representation that take one to the framework of warfare while uncovering the effects of larger 20th century post-war existence. To the Philippine-born Concepcion, OMG Christ depicts the juxtaposition of the nostalgic religious references of his childhood and the pop art culture he has been exposed to since his adolescent years. The Bang and Cheek piece captures the tension between religion and art, tradition and modernity in a light-hearted manner. Elmer Mesa Berlongan He was born on January 7, 1967. He was a prominent contemporary Filipino painter, best known for his distinctive use of figurative expressionism. His famous artwork is called Rehimen, which signifies socialist period and this image is clearly socially aware, depicting a seat of power inspired by Marlboro Seal guarded by a flock of dogs. Below them is a gun figure, which the artist says it represents the marginalized Filipinos. Tawayan Bigeya is a Baguio City-based artist and curator, whose practice spans painting, installation, and sculpture. His famous artwork is the Kawayan's Fume. It's based on a caged Baguio souvenir, the hand ashtray. Patricia Perez Estacio. She is considered one of the leading Filipino artists of her generation. Her famous artwork is called Everywhere West, Everything East. Yavos Gallery Sydney is pleased to present Filipino artist Patricia Perez Estacio in her first solo exhibition in Australia. Neil Pasilan is a Filipino Asian modern and contemporary artist who was born on 1970 in Negros Occidental. Pasilan's famous artwork is the Magasawang Habang Buhay, which emphasizes the bond and commitment. This is Dex Fernandez. Dex Fernandez is an interdisciplinary artist based in Caloocan, born 1984. Dex said, when he turned his experiences into art, he wants people to think about the art and use their imagination so they can have their own representation or perception about the art. He also wants to hear their reaction. Oscar Villamil is a multimedia artist who produces large-scale installation work through the coalition and collecting of found materials from urban and rural environments. Oscar Villamil Payatas 2012 is an installation of thousands of dolls salvaged from a Manila landfill, an evocative parallel of how its inhabitants forage through this landscape of refuse for usable items. Martha Achanza, 1981-present. Achanza is known as director and producer. She was born to a Dutch mother and Filipino father. She received a degree of Bachelor in Fine Arts from the Academy of Visual Arts and Design in the Netherlands. One of the artwork of Marta Achanza is entitled Our Islands 2017. She is currently interested in using contemporary art as an aid to bring about social change. In 2017, she won the Bowie's Art Prize at Art Basel International Fair 
for her video in Salatan or Island.